time for study them. They study we. And then we over and say, ah, they talk like this. So because they talk like this, when we speak in our native tongue, they say, oh, we don't understand. So then why is it that then when we speak like this, you still don't seem to grasp what we've said for decades, for centuries, that you shouldn't build in all these places that you're building on shorelines into our marsh, into our ocean. So the movement of Slum Dwellers International began to give a face, a voice, an identity to all of us who live informally with a view that we have an opinion, we have survived despite everybody and the indifference of the state, but we are your citizens, we demand your attention, and we want to solve the problems of our city with you. We can't impose solutions from, from outside positions, whether that's within nations or internationally. And we, we really have to be listening and, and co-creating, collaborating on these solutions. Kiribati, um, you know, the Marshall Islands, the Maldives, these are all places with less than a meter of sea rise uh, and they are being devastated right now. So we need to ask them first and foremost, what are their responses that they would like to take? And in, in nearly all those cases, I can tell you, they don't want to be given, a, you know, uh, they don't want to be told what to do, that they have to move or migrate or something else. It's a much more complex set of choices. And so I think we should prioritize and ask them and be people-led first and foremost. Once the people are on board, mostly uh, they're, whether political heads or community heads, they, they feel like, well, this is going to succeed anyways. So. I, I better be part of it. I want to be part of the success story. I thought all over the world one plus one equal two. And that meant that if the two of us could get together and we could agree on something, we would go ahead and get to work and we would get it done. But what we are saying is, there have been more than one plus one gathering for over a decade and they're not getting anything done. <laughs>